Shiv Sena MLA Dilip Lande is leaving for Guwahati from Surat. So the camp for Shinde there getting bigger. Arvind Savant of the Shiv Sena is joining us on this broadcast. Mr. Savant, this isn't looking good for the Shiv Sena. For, the, uh, for those of you who are backing Udav Thakre, numbers, uh, you know, more and more going in favor of Eknath Shinde right now. You know, if the numbers go, it doesn't make insurance the legal action will be taken against them because uh, the, all those the activities are illegal. And uh, it is, uh, as per the Constitution of India, we have served the petition, we have already uh, submitted the petition to the Honorable Deputy Speaker of the Assembly to disqualify all these members who have left without any notice. And when we have served the notice to attend to a meeting, they did not attend the meeting yesterday, and therefore they before yesterday. So therefore, we have served the notice of, uh, we have served the petition mm. to the Honorable Speaker to disqualify them. Let us see what happens. Now it is a legal battle okay. as well as a political battle. And everyone knows who is behind this. Mr. Savant, we've spoken to Eknath Shinde. We had a long conversation with him this morning. He's saying that this is an attempt to scare him and all the other MLAs who are backing him, that this is almost a threatening tactic that Udhav Thakur is resorting to as far as disqualification is concerned. Second, he's saying that he has the number of 37 Shiv Sena MLAs with him. He maintains that I am the legislative party leader. See, the number will be decided on the floor of the house, not outside. Try to understand that. There are people, they were in contact with us, they were pursuing that we have been forcibly kept in the camp. We are not allowed to move somehow. Two people have left it, escaped from their, uh, on their cage. But then uh, others are still, either willfully there or not. Nobody knows it. Sir, but that, because of that only is every day calling everyone. Sir, that is something that was everyone. immediately contested because yesterday after these two MLA spoke out, there were pictures of them taking selfies in luxury planes. It didn't look like they were being yeah, forced yeah, at all to stay it there. Was, it, was, it was all strategically taught to them what to do. They are not, see, today one uh, uh, audio clip is has been issued by one of the uh, uh, MLAs from the somewhere from Bandarwood. Now he says, we have been told not to talk to anyone. After three, four days, we are now realized we have got the number and I am telling you, I am going to become the minister. And therefore I have left. You can very well check up in Marathi channel, they are showing it. That shows, no, it is they were in the camp. Who were protecting them? The BJP government officials. Now, That's a way spoken. Gujarat Mr. government was there. Where in Assam? Where in Assam? See, today one, one of the Shiva said, he to uh, Assam, Guwahati, and asked him to go back to Shiva Sena, uh, Udavji Thakare. And there he was arrested now. But look at these Assam. pictures, sir. There are pictures of all these MLAs who were complaining yesterday. They're taking selfies outside a chartered plane. They're showing okay, off yes, they the are, good time they're they having. Are, we spoke to Mr. Deepak Kesarkar today morning and he also has said that I am willfully there. I have decided to take this step very consciously. Maybe, maybe. I don't want to contest on that right now. The reasons for which he has given a letter to us in, in which he has mentioned that there was a bomb behind us, below his uh, residence. I was trying to come out and then uh, the, my car was chased by someone. And then finally, right, my missus is not well. And now you just think of a reason. When somebody's wife is ill, he leaves her without taking her care, due care and goes to go out. You just think of it how many people are lying now. That's all. That's, that's, a, that's an example. We can produce that later. About what so do you believe? That. There he says, yeah, I should be allowed to remain abstain from the meeting. Are these MLAs, sir, to you, are, are they doing this out of force or are they traitors? See, uh, we have, we have appealed them to come back. Let us go. Let us remain within the party. I'll talk to the boss and then see what fact is to be done. Even yesterday, uh, Sanjay Raut has also said, come, whatever your plea is there, we can follow with the party. But the clauses are very different. See, mm -hmm. they can form the they can say we are two third, yeah. or more than that. With the we are with, but they cannot remain as a Shiv Sena. They will have to merge in the political party. Yeah, that's the point. And that's the point Mr. Ekna is making, Mr. Savant. Since you wanted to leave Shiv Sena. No, they're saying we are the real Shiv Sena. The numbers are with us. We are the real Shiv Sena. 
the amendment which was carried in 87 88 says that they they can go for a second prove that we have a majority of two third people with us and then what will happen they cannot remain as a separate uh, group in the assembly they will have to merge with someone hmm. and when the merger comes the issue of merger will come and the people they all these have to join bjp then the issue will come then you will come to know the truth <laughs> whether they were really <laughs> They were really with Shiv Sena. Hmm. They had a Shiv Sena in their heart or not. And today they are BJP members. That, that's the that's final issue. Mr. Savan, one okay. final question to you. Your response to all of these allegations that the rebel MLAs have been putting forth that Rudolf Thakri was inaccessible, that they were humiliated constantly when they tried to meet him at Mantra Lai. Uh, you must uh, consider what, what has happened in the past. I know in the last three years, you should think of it, almost two and a half years. Two years have gone into Corona. Hmm. Nobody knows. Yes, he has life in this country. The people of the Maharashtra state. Not only that, he was admired. He was uh, selected as the uh, best chief minister of the country. Twice, five chief ministers were there. He was one of them. Twice, twice, four times, the uh, survey was considered by some private, um, and they have said that he is one of the finest chief ministers. It's bad that he had to go for a major surgery. But they're saying Congress NCP leaders God, could meet him survived. not. He survived. We pray. We pray God, the, God the God's blessing. He survived from that. And during that, his movements were restricted. No, I agree. I agree that he's like had this. a lot of, uh, uh, you know, a, a medical incidents as well. But they're during saying that, that he's period, met with Congress and NCP leaders. Also. That Congress and NCP leaders could meet him not us. One moment, but one moment, the crisis are there in our house, not with the NCP. Right now, when my leader is in critical condition, you are so inhuman to criticize him and trouble him. And that is what Maharashtra is looking after it. Yesterday, when he spoke to the people of the Maharashtra on Facebook, people cried. We have never seen such a cultured um, chip minister is, in is, the line of Yashwantra Chavan and others. This is Shiv Sena yeah. slipping away from the Thakre's, Mr. Arvind Savant, what's considered to be synonymous? Thakre and Shiv Sena, is that changing? He has officially, he has really, he has uh, immediately vacated his residence also. Don't forget that also. Hmm. <laughs> he's that sort of person. He's not greedy of power. That is what he has shown by his actions. Now the people who have gone for a power should come back and tell them, you are so... He is he's ready to relinquish why you are continue, want to continue with BJP. Nobody can, everybody knows who is playing but, the role. But then this. what's stopping Mr. Udav Thakre from resigning? No, 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 you don't ask for that. We, we know this is a political battle, it's a legal battle. Okay. Now that legal battle will start, if they come, what he has said, I am ready to resign. I mean, shh, say it on my face. All of you come and say, sir, we don't believe in you. We don't have a trust in your leadership. So therefore, we want to join with the Shinde. Mm -hmm. I will there and there itself be give the resignation in your hand, submit it to the governor, and will not continue to be the chief minister of Parliament. What more you need? Okay. All right. Uh, Mr. Arvind Savant, yes, thank you. Thank you, sir, for joining us here on India Today.